What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. This right here is something I don't ever want to see. Damn it. This right here, you guys made me laugh because I'm like, holy shit, what did I do? Like, I have ran these ads a million times. So why in the hell am I, am I getting this one disapproved? Um, and so after I looked into it more, I, I, kept, I kept wondering, what the heck was it? Like, I complied with everything. It's a simple video. Um, I'm going to play the video for you guys, but um, simple real estate video. And as you go into, um, into the actual, uh, you click on the green button, create, and then you go into the actual setup. As I mentioned on, on, it, on my previous videos, if you're in any of these categories, this is the newest update from Facebook, the special ad category. So if you're in housing or if you're in employment, you're looking to, you know, advertise for employment, you're looking to hire people, you're looking for internships, you're looking for people to work for you, right? Anything related to employment or anything related to credit or anything related to housing, you, you simply have to just comply. And as you go through the setup, um, let's say, for example, you go housing and if, the, and if it's your first time doing it, you go through the setup and it's, it's normally on the ad set or on the ad where you'll have to just click on it and, and agree to the policy, which is super simple. You just click a couple buttons and, and now you comply. It's all good. So I've done that already, right? I've done that already and it still disapproved it. And I'm like, dude, what the hell is wrong? And so as I looked into it more, which I'm going to show you what it was, and it just made me laugh. I'm like, dang, dude, these Facebook, they have it down. They're not, they're not allowing, you know, they're not, they're not dumb. You know what I mean? They're catching everything and it'll be the smallest thing that they'll disapprove you on, you know? So I'm going to show this to you guys and, and, and this is just going to help you guys, you know, with your advertising in the future, um, because you for sure don't want to get it, you know, disapproved. So this is the email you'll receive. And then when I click on view ad, it takes me into the ads manager where I can look into it even further to see what it was. So it's in review, but it's not, I'm not going to, I'm going to end up just pulling it down and, and, and having, and having the client co edit it or do a different one. Um, but this is what it was. This is what they got me for was alcohol. It's crazy. When I looked at that, I'm like alcohol. I'm like, dude, it's a real estate agent. It's a freaking video of a house. Like what the hell? And then I watched the video again and I'm like, holy crap, they, they saw that. So let me, let me play this video for you guys. And, and so, yeah, this is, this is the violation all because of this simple, it's a walkthrough of a, of a property, right? Simple, normal video that a million real estate agents do, but look at what's in the background. Look at what you get, you guys end up seeing. All because of that, you guys. All because of those bottles that are on the countertop there. Wow. So this particular client, she obviously spent some money on getting this video, you know, produced. It, it, she hired a camera crew and all that. And so it, it, it won't be too hard to simply edit that part. I'm sure she, she's going to have to reach out to her camera guy and, and simply, you know, um, um, have them just edit that part out if she wants to continue to use that video, which I'm assuming she would want to because she spent some money on the damn video. So that right there, you guys will get your Facebook ad disapproved all because of that simple placement of an, of, of a bottle of alcohol. So when you, when you come into here even more, see more info ads that promote or reference alcohol must comply with all applicable, applicable local laws required or established industry codes, guidelines, licenses, and approvals, and include age and county targeting criteria consistent with Facebook's targeting guidelines and applicable, applicable local laws. 
So this is crazy, right? I mean, she obviously has no liquor license. So targeting requirements, if you choose to run ads that promote or reference alcohol, you must make sure to follow local laws and target your ads appropriately, including targeting your ads to 18 years or older in all permitted countries except the following. So it shows you India and then other countries, um, 21 and older. And so that's the thing, with a, with a housing ad, you, you have to target 18 and up. You cannot change the demographics. You can't change the gender. Or no, you could change the demographics, but you can't change the actual um, um, age. So, so with housing, you have to, like, let's go back to, um, let's go back to the setup. As you go in and run an run a ad for housing, um, and housing applies for everything, not just a real estate agent. If you're in the, if you're in the mortgage industry, um, you have to comply to housing as well. Watch, let me, let me show you. So, so here's the biggest thing with the biggest change with when it comes to housing and housing, again, it's for real estate listings, homeowners, insurance, mortgage loans, or other related opportunities. So even, even if you're in the insurance industry and you're running ads, you simply just click on this one and, and comply. No big deal. But the, but the thing is, is that when you come in and let's just say we're running engagement, I just want to kind of show you the next page or the next step, I should say, which right now we're in the campaign level. When we go to the ad set, here's the biggest thing that changed with housing um, is the fact that you cannot change the age. So you can change the locations. You could target whoever you want. You can't target by zip code, though. You have to target by city or state or, or simple location. But you cannot change the age. So because of this video, there, Facebook's telling me that I have to, that it has to, it has to target only people 21 and up if I have those liquor licenses, right? Which obviously we don't. But in this case, running it to the U.S. or running it to anyone in any anywhere in the U.S., any city what whatsoever, I can't change the age. So that's that was the biggest change with Facebook this year for real estate agents is that you have to target everyone 18, 65 and up. You cannot no longer you can no longer um, change the age, which we used to change the age all the time, um, but now we cannot. Now detail targeting, you can still target whoever you want, but it's the age and the gender. You cannot target just women or just men. You have to target everyone. Um, and so with, with, with that liquor placement, there's no way we're going to be able to you know, get that ad approved. So in cases like this, you guys, do not put bottles of, of, of liquor in your videos or you will get them disapproved. All right. So just wanted to share that, you guys. I, I got this email yesterday and I'm like, wow, that's funny. And so now I have to reach out to the client and say, hey, man, you're going to have to reach back out to your camera guy to edit that little part. And as long as we can edit that little part, we can for sure run it again. And I'm and, and I'm I'm 100 percent sure we'll get approved on it. But um, unless we edit that little part, you know, you're not going to be able to use this video um, when it comes to Facebook ads. Now, she could for sure ch you could for sure, you know, post it on, on social media, post it on your Facebook business page, post it on your personal page, whatever. But as far as running an actual Facebook or Instagram ad, you'll be disapproved. OK, so just wanted to share that with you guys. Uh, make sure you're complying with with all of Facebook's, you know, legalities and, and you'll be fine. All right, guys. See you on the next video. Over now.